MTV. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> we have to walk, Kayla. Come on. Hi guys, my name is Kaylin and I'm the president of NCAD Students' Union. My name is Quiva and I'm the vice president. We'd like to welcome you to NCAD's virtual open day. We're going to bring you around campus and show you what it's like to be a student here at NCAD. So this is the Harry Clark building, it's home to visual culture. The gallery and textiles art and artifacts. So we're on the second floor of the Harry Clark building now. Over on this side we have the doctor's office, the counselor's office and the careers guidance office. And over here is the final year TAA studios which is fine art textiles. So the TAA department is Textiles, Art and Artifact. It's located on the top floor of the Harry Clark in the admin building. It has two workshops with a multi-head embroiderer, multiple knit machines and a sewing machine. These are some of the media workshops in the admin building. We have the photography darkroom and we also have the photographic studio, which is over to the right. So we're here in Grey Square and just to the left of us we have the media studios for second and third year students. And then right behind us we have the jewellery and object studios, again for the second and third year students. This is Ceramics and Glass. It's the home to the students of second and third year. There's a kiln, a glass room, and a project space in here. This is the Granary Building. It's home to fine art paint, sculpture, print, design, fashion, and textile surface design. and it's also home to the library and the atrium. So this is the second floor of the Granary Building, which is home to both the fashion department and also a part of the textile and surface design department. Can't see it under my mask, I just did a beautiful smile there. But it doesn't really come across as that. So this is the painting department on the top floor of the granary where all of the painting studios are for second and third year. So we're on the second floor of the granary building right now which is also home to the Edward Murphy Library. The Edward Murphy Library hosts the most comprehensive collection of contemporary art books in Ireland. There's over 90,000 books in the library and most of the staff that work in the library are fine art and design grads and are very knowledgeable on the subjects that are in here. NIVAL is a public research resource and it's open to all students and members of the public. NIVAL collects, stores and makes accessible an unparalleled collection of documentation of Irish art in all formats including books, catalogues, videos, slides, artist papers and ephemera. So we're here in Red Square at the moment, which is one of the communal areas for students here in NCAD. Just behind us, we have the granary building, which we've just come from. And then here we have the pot stills, back from when NCAD used to be the Powers Whiskey Distillery. And then just behind us here, we have the design building, which is home to the first year studios, the education course, product design and the visual communications department. So the communications design course is made up of moving image design, illustration and graphic design and they're all on the first floor of the design building. So downstairs in the design building we also have product design, interaction design and medical device design. 
So this is the concourse, which is another communal area in NCAD. This is the office behind us, which is the NCAD Students' Union office, which is for student support and welfare. So also off the concourse, we have the admissions office, reception and IT support. Downstairs, we have the luncheonette, which is our student canteen run by the lovely Jenny, who is an ex-fine arts student in NCAD. The Annex building on James's Street is traditionally used by NCAD's MFA students, but is currently home to the Studio Plus students of NCAD. Thanks so much for coming on the tour with us, and we hope to see you in college next year. Wow! <laughs>